with another banger. We're going to be talking about XRP USD for Ripple. Um, let me go ahead and write that out for you guys. So we're going to go over all new levels for Ripple. Ripple is moving very nicely and now it's starting to have some pullback. So now will be the time that I will be looking to enter, right? Because the run already happened. So I don't want to really be chasing price. So now that we're coming back down, now is the time. So make sure you guys smash the like button, subscribe if you are new. I'm going to give you guys some new levels on XRP USD. The ticker symbol is right there. Make sure you watch the video before this one on ApeCoin. ApeCoin can go and say within 72 hours. Make sure you watch that video. is right before this one. So XRP had a couple old levels on here. I had a support level about 33 cents. Support held. We had the run up. Rent When it was up here, right, I gave you guys a resistance level and a buying level. It kind of dropped down. Oh, let me zoom in a little. So it kind of dropped down a little below the buying level. Buying pressure came off of that. Hit that resistance level. Resistance turned to a what? Support. Support here. And then it actually started going higher. So the levels did pretty good. Now, new level. So I'll give you guys. It's actually at a buying pressure level now. So I'll, I'll kind of put one that it is at now. But I have another one below price. So I'll put one here. It's kind of at one now. So we'll kind of see how that plays out. And then I'll put a resistance up here. And then I'll put our support down here, right? So these are kind of the new levels that I'll be looking out for on XRP. So I'll go ahead and write them out. This is the resistance level, about 48 cents 50. 48 cents 50 is a resistance level we need to be watching out for. If XRP is going to continue that run, we will know that once this resistance level breaks, right? That's going to show strength. Right now, it's steadily breaking support levels. So it's still coming down. On that downward side now support is about 39 cents even i'll put it at 39 cents even let's put that down there and now we have two buying levels is that one now so it could take off from there or it might break that buying level and come down lower to the second one so the first buying level is about 44 cents 10 because when you have a penny penny this low every dollar amount matters and then we have one more down here, about 0, 0.481, okay? So it's not Pacific level, it's just in that area. So in the area is it now, in the area it is now, in the area it is now, and in the area right there. So now these are our main four levels we want to be watching out for. Now, like I said, it could take off from here, go to the resistance level. But what we want is we don't want it to break, right? We want it to break and actually hold support and then go higher. That's going to show more strength than this movement right here okay and that goes with any amount so even if it comes all the way down here and it starts to go up we still wanted to find support at higher prices because notice on this run it ran up found support at higher prices ran up support at higher prices ran up drop down support higher prices support higher prices support and it just kept running until it started breaking that support now it's finding support at lower prices okay so that's kind of the move we want to see on xrp main levels i'm looking out for if any of these levels change I will let you guys know if I buy any of this, make sure you join the team. It's that first thing in the description to join the crypto team. Prices go up in about four days on Saturday. So thank you guys for watching. Always remember, no recommendation to buy or sell anything. Just for educational purposes only. So do not trade anything you see or hear in the video. I will catch you guys in that next one. Bye.